Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little bit of a vlog. I'm just waiting for my spa laser center to open for my fifth laser hair removal appointment. I do um, get one treatment a month. And I've been doing my chin hair. All of it's gone here. This will be my, yeah, this will be my fifth. So I've had four treatments. The right side's gone. The left side's almost gone. I'm assuming after the two treatments. When I purchased it, I thought it was for my mustache, as you guys can see, and my chin hair. But they said it was only for one. I got it on Groupon. I think I paid $129, basically $130 bucks for six treatments. So six months worth. Um, and like I said, I thought it was for both, but it's not. And I didn't want to go ahead and pay for my mustache because I said I can't have two Groupons at once. And I wasn't going to pay like, you know, I wanted that discount. So, um, yeah, after my chin, I'm going to go ahead and do my mustache which, um, but yeah, like after four months, the, this right side's gone. They said it's normal for the left side to take longer because, um, you know, it's hormones. So I am, um, 38. So, and I'm Italian and Cuban. So, but yeah, my hair is dirty. I didn't wash my hair. I just washed my body. Um, today is Thursday, September 13th. I'm growing out my eyebrows again. Like I grew them out. And then, um, I got him wax and I, I cannot keep going to the nail salon because they keep making them too thin and you guys know thick is in. Um, so I don't know, as you guys can see, I'm like growing them in again and, and, um, but yeah, so I got no makeup on. But yeah, I'm just waiting for them to open my appointment. It's 8.44. My appointment's at 9 o'clock. Um, so I got here early because after um, I went to my other house, I cleaned the kitchen, the living room, the laundry room, and Frankie's room. Did not touch the boys' room. But I did clean. Um, it was so dusty and dirty there. So, um, But yeah, I cleaned that. Um... So, and then I was like, oh, you know, might as well leave. I did get some of my stuff to bring back to my house. And, but yeah, I still got a lot of stuff to get from, you know, the other house to bring to my new house. So, um, yeah, a lot of you guys have asked questions about what's going on. Um, you know, and, and I am going to address that, but... I'm just waiting for, I'm in a um, court battle right now. Um, if you know, you know. And I'm just kind of out of respect. I'm just kind of just, and to make sure nothing's used against me. Um, I'm just kind of, dang, she's fit. Um, just kind of staying silent for right now. I think I got like 30 more days, maybe. I'm not sure. I'll have to um, double check on that. But, um, yeah, uh soon you guys soon 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 um i am tired i woke up at 3 30 i've been waking up at 3 30 a lot a lot of it has to do with stress my weight loss isn't doing too good i uh, i mean as far as me i've been working out and drinking water which i need some water right now but um i'm just not losing it i'll lose like a pound and then i'll gain it back you know i think it's just stress to be honest with you so, um, oh, there's my laser girl. So, um, yeah, I highly recommend. She's just now opening the door. I got 14 minutes. Um, I highly recommend um, this place. I really like it. They, they do all kinds of stuff, but I really need to get my hair trimmed. Um, but this place is like appointment only and it's more expensive, so... But yeah, anyways, I I haven't been sleeping well. Um, like I said, I woke up at 3.30. It was actually uh, Frank's birthday today, September 13th. So I did surprise him and the kids with uh, donuts and stuff. I went at 5 in the morning, got all that, woke them all up. And um, 
fucking won't do that to And then um, stayed there, cleaned up, starting at like 5.15, cleaned up the house, got Frankie to school by 7.40, so I cleaned the house for two, a little over two hours, and then I uh, just headed this way, and then I'm going to go back to my house, so, um, huh. All the girls here are so pretty. I hate coming in like this, but I can't wear makeup, you know, when you're getting laser hair on your face and, you know, no creams or nothing like that. And you're not allowed to wax or shave. So that's why, I mean, no, you're not allowed to wax or pluck. You're only allowed to shave. So that's why I got my five o'clock shadow. Mm -hmm. But, um, cause you know, I don't want to irritate the skin and then, um, but yeah, uh, not much going on today. At least I don't think so. I'm probably going to take a nap later. I'm expecting some phone calls that I need to handle. And I was going to go through my emails. I got a couple companies that um, want to do a collaboration. So I'm waiting on those products. So um, my hair is pretty gray. I'm starting to, as I notice, uh, thin out up here. Can you guys see that thinning out? I'm not sure what I can use. I don't know if it's my age, hormones, or what. If you guys have any recommendation. Obviously, I have a lot of hair, but it's thinning out right here. So, um, I'm a little concerned about that. I was told that once you hit a certain age, it starts happening. I don't know. My mother's a drug addict, so I can't go to my mother and say, Mom, is this normal for a woman? So, you ladies comment down below and let me know. Um, is like the 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 whiskers going everywhere and the thinning of hair. I'll be um, 39 in uh, December, so a couple months, so close to my 40s, y'all. And um, I know some people said that um, even though I'm still young, um, or considered young, I, I'm not young, but um, that since I started, you know, because I started my girlfriend at nine years old, and then I've uh, had started uh, getting pregnant. Um, I got pregnant with my daughter at 16. So, um, had her at 17, then got pregnant, and then she passed at birth and got pregnant with Justice at 17, had him at 18, and then blah, 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 blah. You know, so, um, they say, like, some of my problems is just uh, having kids early and stuff like that. But you guys comment down below. Let me know. Are you guys having that problem? As far as, like, my nails and everything, everything grows. But it's just, um, I don't know. But I've been taking um, lots of vitamins here lately. I've been taking a biotin pill, I think it's called. I don't know. It's for hair. Um... So hopefully that helps, but I don't know. I turn my car off to save for gas because your girl is trying to save that money. Because my electric bill, for some reason, even though I wasn't home, doubled. I almost feel like my neighbor is stealing my electricity. I'm going to have to go check on that. Unless, I don't know. But it is raining. It just rained this morning. Um, it's a little shopping center. And a bar and Enterprise and yeah. Um, but yeah, I, uh, it was raining. I think it's going to rain again tonight. It's starting to cool off in Texas a little bit, or at least this week, I guess. So I will have to let you guys know, um, how my day goes. I already kind of cleaned my house. I just need to mop half of it. And, um, yeah, my house is pretty much clean. And then I clean the other house, so. Not much to do today. And obviously on laser hair treatment days, I don't put on makeup or anything because you don't want to irritate the skin. So I'm going to kind of be like this all day. So I'm not going to show much of my face the rest of the video. All right. Well, we are done with our treatment and I'm at home. You can't really tell, but it's real red today because she upped the setting. Um, because like I said, I'm still having problems with my, um, left side. And they gave me an ice pack. She wanted me to ice it. So, but yeah, 
I just put bleach in the toilets at my house. Um, I'm here, as you guys can see. I need to wash my bedroom bedding, but I don't know if I'm going to get to it. I'm going to ice this up. I just took a couple phone calls. I did see if her lady was there um, to give me a haircut because I looked at the prices and the shampoo and haircut's 40 bucks, which for my hair is really good. <laughs> and uh, she wasn't there. I have to make an appointment, so that sucked. And then I was like thinking of, oh, I may just get my eyebrows shaped but then i was like eh, i'll do that on a day because i was hurting when i left today it feels like um getting snapped by a rubber band but yeah i definitely need to for christmas that's what i want my mustache done because it does work i'm telling you guys this this side's done but she still treats the other side she treats so it's right under my lip over here over here and under can you guys see the redness so, I'm just going to ice it up a little bit, and then um, you're supposed to put sunscreen, but I'm not going um, outside into the sun, so I don't think I need to. God, my eyebrows are bad. So, I don't think I need to, but fun, fun, fun. Ooh, it's empties time. So I'm going to add this into my vlog. I went through a good and clean disinfectant wipes. This is from Dollar Tree. There's 30 wipes in here. This stuff is really good. They have the yellow one too. And that one is really good. So it's a good deal you guys. And um, really good to donate to your kids school or classroom. So highly recommend that. I went through the Kroger brand uh, makeup removing wipes. These were also really good. For a discount, it's comparable to the Neutrogena, and I'd say it definitely is. So that will be um, a repurchase. Little Frankie finally went through, I think I went through the last of it, but um, the Colgate um, mouthwash. It was okay. Um, it's Ryan's Bubble Fruit. It did not burn Frankie, um, but I don't know. My kids really don't use a whole lot of mouthwash. I don't know. Do y'all's kids use it? Um, went through Bath and Body Works Strawberry Pound Cake. Um, I ended up mixing some other body wash that I was almost done with and put it in here. Really love the Strawberry Pound Cake scent. Highly recommend it. If you haven't smelt it, definitely smell it. Ooh, went through another Bath and Body, a Country Apple Spray. Country Apple is one of my favorite scents from Bath and Body. It's just a nice apple scent. Highly recommend. This I got from Dollar Tree. You guys have seen this many times. It's a palm olive spray away, the dish spray. I even use this to clean my bathroom. I'm obsessed with the scent of this, you guys. Highly recommend if you can find it at Dollar Tree. I haven't found it in a while, but if you can, stock up and buy a ton. This stuff works really good. I like it better than the Dawn Dish Spray one. And went through an Equate and Acid like Tums. This is the Walmart brand. It works just like the name brand, so recommend if you can save them coins. This is from Dollar Tree as well. Now, you guys, this is a Jelly Belly Vanilla Air Freshener. Did not put this in my car. I put it in my bathroom. It's actually hanging right there, that little thing on the, um, right there. Oh, my God. My bathroom smells amazing. Amazing. It's so strong. Highly recommend. When I go back to Dollar Tree, if they have some more of these, I'm stocking up. Um, I also found the pear one. I haven't opened that one up. But you guys, the vanilla, oh, it's amazing. This just came out of my car, which reminds me I need to pull another one out. This is Scentsy. This was watermelon tangerine. This worked really well in my car. And there's no scent left. So, like that one. Went through a Scentsy bulb in 25 watts. Went through some vapes. This is Balzo. This is 10,000 puffs and what? Oh, sour apple ice. Love this. Um, 
opens up like that, rechargeable. Really love this one, highly recommend. And then went through a um, e.l.f. bar strawberry kiwi. This is in the 5,000 puff. And this is what it looks like. I really like this, oop, this scent as well. There you go. And then we got a couple wax melts, not too many. Um, currently um, melting in my bedroom and living room kitchen area. Rainbow melts, pomegranate cider, spice cider, pomegranate, and strawberry. To me, it doesn't smell like any of that. It smells like bubble gum to my nose. Strawberry. Mm, I don't know, like hub, hubba bubba bubble gum. So um, I wanted to use this up. I thought it would be, you know, I'd, I'd smell some cider. I did smell that on cold, but on warm, I don't smell it. I mean, it smells good. It just doesn't smell like those scent notes. Okay. And then I went through Scentsy Coconut for Coconuts. This smells amazing. True authentic coconut, almost sunscreeny smell, and lasts for like almost four days. So highly recommend. And then a peeling apple lasted about three days. Nice true apple scent. I mean, yes, I love it, love it, love it. And that is my empties. I'm going to close out this video. I hope you guys enjoyed a little vlog about my um, laser hair removal and my empties. If you guys haven't already, please do not forget to hit that subscribe button. And thanks so much for watching.